One month before election, sheriffs in the east are receiving complaints of stolen campaign signs. The most recent thefts are in Carteret County. Someone wants to place a political sign for one candidate, someone wants to do one for another. That's their right of free speech that we recognize in our in our country. Carteret County Sheriff Asa Buck says his deputies have received many calls about stolen or damaged campaign signs within the last few weeks. Some of the swipe signs were along roadways, while others are taken from people's yards. Buck says this happens almost every election season, but he's not standing for it. Pull up 10 signs, that doesn't mean 10 less votes uh, on election day. And so really the only thing they're doing is uh, they're, they're breaking the law and they're subjecting themselves to being arrested and prosecuted uh, for a misdemeanor offense. I reached out to both the Democratic and Republican parties of Carteret County. Democratic Chairwoman Katie Tomberlin says she's noticed Biden-Harris signs were gone within 48 hours of her putting them out. My best guess would be 150 to 175 total. They're also being stolen off of people's personal property. Tomberlin says it's important for both major political parties to be represented during election season, not just one. I reached out and visited the Carteret County Republican Party. Workers there tell me they are unable to speak about sign thefts, even their own. I also reached out to the North Carolina GOP, but no one from the party responded. Other sheriffs in the East are reporting stolen campaign sign thefts, including in Pamlico and Onslow counties. Pamlico County Sheriff Chris Davis says anyone taking part in those thefts will be arrested. If you have information on political sign thefts, contact your local sheriff's office. In Moorhead City, I'm Kayla Schmidt, 9 on your side.